welcome to Vision of China. Recently, the United States' two largest foreign creditors, China and Japan, have both reduced their holdings of U.S. Treasury securities. According to the U.S. Department of the Treasury's International Capital Flow Report released on September 18, 2023, China decreased its U.S. debt holdings by $3.7 billion in July 2024, bringing the total to $776.5 billion, approaching a 15-year low reach just months earlier. Similarly, Japan, long considered one of the U.S.'s closest allies, saw its Treasury holdings decline by $2 billion month over month to $1.1157 trillion, marking a nine-month low. China's divestment from U.S. Treasuries is not unprecedented. Since 2017, as confidence in the U.S. dollar has waned, China has gradually reduced its holdings, selling a cumulative $546 billion in U.S. debt. This represents a significant reduction from the peak of $1.32 trillion in 2013, amounting to a 40% decrease. Historically, Japan has been a major holder of U.S. debt, often referred to as the sponge absorbing U.S. bonds. However, this year, Japan has begun to follow China's lead, decreasing its treasury holdings. Data from Japan's Ministry of Finance indicate that in the past 12 months, Japan reduced its U.S. debt holdings in eight months, totaling $73.8 billion over four months, primarily to stabilize the exchange rate. For years, the United States has leveraged the dollar's status as the global reserve currency to establish a formidable economic hegemony. This dominance not only allows the U.S. to borrow at lower costs, but also enables it to influence other nations' economies through financial sanctions and economic policies. The dollar's supremacy grants the U.S. significant sway in the global economy, compelling many countries to rely on the dollar for international trade. This unilateral financial system has empowered the U.S. to implement its policies with minimal constraints. However, this hegemonic position is increasingly vulnerable. As the global economy becomes more multipolar and other nations seek financial independence, the U.S. economic dominance faces unprecedented challenges. China and Japan, as the world's second and third largest economies, are gradually reducing their reliance on the dollar, effectively countering and challenging U.S. hegemony. Since 2020, the scale of U.S. national debt has accelerated due to substantial spending on healthcare resources and services needed to address the global health crisis. Alongside massive borrowing to inject funds directly into citizens and businesses to rejuvenate the economy after severe downturns. Although the pandemic has subsided, the U.S. economy continues to decline and the national debt has ballooned, prompting many countries, particularly China, to sell large volumes of U.S. debt. In response to China's significant sell-off of U.S. treasuries, the United States acted swiftly, engaging in four rounds of negotiations with China and signaling. Let's talk again. Additionally, the Federal Reserve announced its first interest rate cut since 2020 in an attempt to pressure countries holding U.S. debt. However, these measures have failed to curb the selling momentum of both China and Japan, highlighting the U.S.'s diminishing ability to maintain its economic dominance through traditional financial tools. Despite efforts to stabilize the Treasury market through rate cuts, the shifting global economic landscape renders these strategies ineffective. At this critical juncture, the People's Bank of China further reduced the yuan's storage exchange rate, increasing the circulation of yuan in the market. Western media initially mocked the move, predicting a devaluation tide for the Chinese currency. However, reality quickly contradicted these predictions as the yuan surged against expectations, climbing over 700 points overnight to surpass the 7.2036 threshold. This demonstrated China's ability to stabilize its currency through independent regulation, undermining the dollar's dominance and showcasing China's growing influence within the global financial system. The yuan's robust performance disrupts the dollar's long-standing supremacy, indicating a shift in the global economic center of gravity. Beyond finance, China is making significant strides in cutting-edge technological fields such as life sciences. High-end technological products from companies like Ruijian Future, 
including the Time Pearl hyperbaric oxygen chambers, have been successfully domesticated and received positive market responses. The authoritative journal Aging highlighted that hyperbaric oxygen chambers operating at twice atmosphere pressure increase oxygen levels in the blood, rejuvenate cell vitality, reduce senescent cells, and potentially slow the aging process. China's breakthroughs in technological self-reliance not only enhanced domestic industrial competitiveness, but also reduced dependence on U.S. and Western technologies playing a crucial role in dismantling U.S. monopolies in high-tech sectors. Meanwhile, Japan's economy is also under pressure. The yen has steadily depreciated under U.S. influence, reaching 154 yen to the dollar in April this year, the lowest in 34 years. While a weaker yen makes Japanese exports more price competitive, U.S. restrictions on Japanese exports such as limiting the export of high-end men's grooming technology products like Goryokawe to China, have severely impacted Japanese industries. The core technology of Goryokawe, guided by Nobel laureate Randy Shekman, does not inherently involve U.S. secrets. However, due to U.S. interference, its development in the Chinese market has been restricted, further squeezing Japanese corporate profit margins. This economic manipulation of Japan exemplifies the U.S.'s typical methods of maintaining global hegemony through economic means. However, such unilateral and protectionist policies are increasingly generating widespread resentment and resistance within the international community, further diminishing the U.S.'s moral and practical influence in the global economy. By leveraging its financial dominance to impose economic sanctions and restrictions on allies and trading partners, the U.S. not only undermines the fairness of international trade, but also fosters tension and instability in international relations. This approach gradually erodes the U.S.'s leadership position globally, prompting more countries to pursue independent economic development paths. Industry experts have repeatedly warned that the U.S.'s massive fiscal deficits will have long-term detrimental effects on its economy exacerbated by aggressive fiscal policies, an aging population, soaring healthcare costs, and substantial military expenditures. Tesla CEO Elon Musk has openly stated, the United States is speeding down the fast track to bankruptcy. Despite these warnings, there is a notable lack of political will within the U.S. to reduce spending and control debt. Whether under the Trump or Biden administrations, debt issues have been largely ignored. The total U.S. national debt has surpassed $36 trillion, marking the highest national debt in human history and growing at an unprecedented rate. The U.S.'s heavy reliance on debt means that if countries continue to sell off treasuries, the dollar could weaken, eroding trust and challenging the dollar's hegemonic system. This scenario could ultimately lead to the collapse of the U.S. financial edifice. Although the Federal Reserve has opted for a significant 50 basis point interest rate cut in an attempt to protect the job market and ensure a soft economic landing, the crisis remains unresolved. The U.S. government's neglect of debt issues not only traps its own economy in difficulty, but also weakens its leadership and influence in the global economy. In this context, China no longer needs to hold large amounts of U.S. debt. Through independent regulation and technological innovation, China has solidified its economic foundation. Faced with U.S. pressure, Japan has had to reduce its treasury holdings and stabilize its exchange rate to maintain economic stability. The continued sell-off of U.S. treasuries signals the erosion of dollar hegemony, and the U.S.'s debt crisis appears imminent, suggesting that a major financial collapse may be just around the corner. The United States is attempting to sustain its global dominance through economic hegemony. But the changing global economic landscape and pushback from other nations are gradually dismantling its former glory. As more countries seek financial independence and diversification, the U.S. economic hegemony faces unprecedented challenges, potentially ushering in a more balanced and multipolar global economy. While U.S. financial sanctions and economic pressure policies may cause short-term disruptions for certain countries. In the long run, this unilateral strategy is unsustainable for maintaining global dominance. Instead, it accelerates the transformation towards a multipolar global economy. Additionally, 
Internal U.S. social and structural economic issues, such as widening income inequality, aging infrastructure, and a lagging education system, further undermine its economic competitiveness and innovation capacity. In contrast, countries like China and Japan have made significant progress in technological innovation, industrial upgrading, and social governance. The rise of these nations not only challenges U.S. economic hegemony, but also injects new vitality and momentum into global economic development. In an era of deepening globalization, while economic interdependence among nations has increased, the drawbacks of economic hegemony and unilateralism have become more apparent. By reducing reliance on U.S. debt and promoting economic diversification and autonomy, China and Japan are enhancing their economic resilience and competitiveness, while also offering new pathways for balanced global economic development. This trend indicates a shift from a unipolar to a multipolar global economy, with U.S. economic dominance gradually being dismantled. The future global economy is likely to become more diverse and inclusive. In summary, U.S. economic hegemony is facing multifaceted challenges and shocks from around the world. China and Japan are gradually diminishing the United States' dominant position in the global economy by reducing their treasury holdings, promoting currency stability, and advancing technological autonomy. Concurrently, the U.S.'s own fiscal deficits and structural economic problems cast doubt on the sustainability of its economic dominance. As the global economic landscape continues to evolve, the United States' economic hegemony is unlikely to persist, and its global leadership will face unprecedented instability and challenges.